welcome back to my channel and welcome back to today's video today's video is all about the forgotten jobs we all have jobs in the kitchen that we forget to do so as you can see my kitchen is already clean because i am just going to be focusing on the areas that i always forget and i think other people forget as well so i'm hoping this video is going to motivate you to clean your kitchen but also to remind you that there are certain areas in the kitchen that need doing so I'm starting with the fan above the hob because I've not done them since we've moved in but as you can see they're not that bad at all but I'm just going to soak them in soapy water for 5-10 minutes and then I'm going to give them a quick wipe down. If you are new here please subscribe if you haven't already and hit the bell just to get a notification when I post so you don't miss anything and also leave this video a thumbs up. Next up I'm moving on to the microwave now I do clean behind the microwave quite regularly so I am just doing this today as part of the clean but it's the inside of the micro that gets left the longest I don't know why I always just clean around things and on things but I forget to actually clean in things so I'm going to be doing that today. I'm also going to leave my Instagram link in the description below if you want to follow me on a more daily basis. I post in my stories every day and it's all just instant clean and motivation if you just need that instant boost and there's lots of home decor on there as well so I will leave that link down below for you. I'm now moving on to the oven and this isn't a deep clean, definitely not, but when I was cooking the other day, I opened the oven door and it's just gross, like the oven itself isn't actually that bad, but the door is pretty grim, so I'm going to give it a nice wipe down on the outside, open it up and I mean look at it it's gross so i'm gonna get some spray gonna get some wipes and gonna try and fix this <laughs> So as soon as I started, I did think I really should be wearing gloves right now because this is so gross, but I was just thought I'm halfway through. But look how much like manky stuff comes off. It's just grease and grime. And so I'm going over it twice just to make sure it is all clean and all shiny. But yeah, I definitely recommend wearing gloves if you're doing this to your oven. I'm now moving over to the toaster. Again, I do always clean behind it because I hate the thought of there being loads of crumbs on the kitchen counter and I'm just giving it a quick wipe over. But again, it is the inside that I always forget to do. Since we've had this, I've never emptied it. As you can see, the back is getting pretty full. So I'm emptying all that out and clearing it out before it starts to overflow everywhere. Now I'm drinking from the bottle as I do. It's like a You're on the, wrong 
the final thing I'm going to be doing is underneath the kitchen cupboards. I'm always doing the kitchen cupboards in literally every clean with me. I like my cupboards to look clean, but I do always forget to do underneath them. So there are marks and I think just from cooking as well, all the grease splatter and everything goes on the cupboards. So remember to do underneath them. I really hope you've enjoyed today's video. Let me know in the comments below if I have forgotten any other forgotten spaces. There's probably so many that I've not even thought about. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are new here and also leave this video a thumbs up and I will see you in the next one.